Good morning, good morning to you. It is Thursday and happy Thursday. What is tomorrow? Yeah, you know it. It's Friday. I bet you're looking forward to it as much as I am. Uh, do I work over the weekend? Yes, I do, as a matter of fact, because I find that it's uh, sometimes nice to put in a little work over the weekend so I, so I have a really, really smooth week. But I've been learning to balance that out with my housework, maybe even do a little bit of housework through through the week, and then anyway, it all it all balances out, and that's what we help people to do at declutter the, at declutter the brain is ways figuring out ways to streamline your life, organize your thoughts and your space so that you can be profitably productive and profit doesn't always have to be just about money no it doesn't uh, all of, all five pillars of your life and i am kitty andrews at declutter the brain let's jump right into today's to this week's topic which is refresh your summer soul you know declutter your summer soul as it were you know why would you want to do that? Why? Because if you're watching this, I bet you're an overachiever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little hard on yourself. And it's hard to stop and smell the roses. Yeah. And we figure, oh, well, I can't get away from work. But what ends up happening is you can end up bitter that, uh, well, all the other kids get to go out and play in the sun and I don't. Wah. All right. Well, we're... Uh, Short little breaks, I have found. Uh, it doesn't have to be a week-long vacation. Short little breaks can make can make all the difference in your outlook. And we're looking at short little things that you can do this week. We're looking this week at short little things you can do. <laughs> all right, Monday we talked about museums. Uh, and even if you don't think you're a museum person, person try one because um, chances are that, uh, it, well, certainly it exercises a different part of your brain, which is what this week is all about, and you may come away with a different point of view. You know, history can be kind of interesting. Uh, also, movie theaters, you could go to a movie, and not only are they not crowded in the summer, I have found, but also they are, what are they? They are air conditioned, yes. Mm. Just, we're leaving the everyday world behind. Tuesday, we looked at pick it. All right, no, not pick your nose. Pick berries, pick fruit. Go if you have a if you're fortunate enough to have a you pick farm uh, near you and a car you can get to, then go do that. The, the fresh air and it's not hard exercise. It's fresh air, peace and quiet as you hyper focus on picking just the right fruit. Just don't eat it all before you get home. And if you don't have a U-Pick farm, maybe try a different part of your grocery store or a different grocery store altogether. Just have a wander around, you know, see, 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 see something different. Cause I get bored really easily. How about you? You get bored easily? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Wednesday, we talked about pet it or not. I'm going to explain that. Visiting even a small zoo can be a welcome respite from our digital world. And uh, even if there's no zoo nearby, there, there are gonna be birds in a nearby park. Every town has a park. The idea is just to slow down and commune with living beings who can't talk back to you or send text messages. <sighs> Just the very thought of that is refreshing. <laughs> Just uh, if you go to the zoo, don't get up close and personal with the tiger. Mm -hmm. Today we're talking about grow it. Now, even if it's just in the, uh, just one pot on a balcony now, I'm, I can, we have a late growing season, so I'm about to plant some, some spinach and some flowers in memory of, of one of my grandmothers. And yeah, it's late, but I know that they'll grow. Um, there's something incredibly calming about nurturing something from seed. Now, if you I have a brown thumb, I can't grow anything. Okay, well then buy a pre-made tomato plant or a begonia or what have you. Our our um, clearing houses or plant warehouses are they're pretty much done. 
but I'm hoping, I think that's just my region, but I'm hoping that you can, you can still find, find uh, pre-made plants at a very good price, I might add. Just remember to water it. That's all you need to do. Get over your mental, remove your mental block to say, I'm going to water it and don't be afraid of it. Trust me, it will nurture you back in your spirit. All right, uh, uh, until tomorrow when we talk about make it, make it, you'll see. Download your seven easy steps to conquer your physical and mental clutter. And while you're there, why not book a quick and free call with me and we'll see if we're a good fit to get you decluttered for life in a jiffy. Mm -hmm. All right, take care. Bye for now.